Hey guys, it's Maddie from Make My Life Maddie, and today is going to be another vlog. And so, yeah, it is um, the 23rd of June, but this video is probably going to go up a little bit later. And I want to get a quick shout out to Flames Gaming again, which I'm giving a shout out to in every single video. But they are very supportive and they are very nice. So you better go check out that channel and remember to like, comment, and share with all your friends. And remember to subscribe to their channel and mine. And also, we're going to be doing a Bean Boozle challenge tomorrow. So make sure you're up for that. And so I'm really excited for that. Um, so yeah, I was um, I was looking at how to um, screen record, like to um, record Minecraft. And thanks to Eric the Whale again, I gave him a shout out last time. Thanks to Eric the Whale, he's the one that made me that um, gave a shout out. I mean, um, said in the comments down below that you need to buy a screen recorder. So those of you who don't like, who don't know how to um, record Minecraft or anything like that, then just download the screen recorder and you can look it up on YouTube and you can find a YouTube video that um, Callan sent me from Flames Gaming. Also, be sure to give Brandon, Callan, and Lucas tons of support because they are very nice and they have really good continent and um and so yeah they play clash royale and all that and i'm kind of going pretty slow on my channel i'm very busy and i apologize but i i am very busy and that's what i do i would have lucy with me right now my puppy but she is actually eating right now sadly but I wanted to tell a little story about her, of how we got her. And if you'd see her, you'd think that she'd really, she's really cute. Maybe she'd go in the Bean Boozle Challenge. Yeah, probably. And I also have big news for the Bean Boozle Challenge video. I have big news. And I hope you see the Bean Boozle Challenge so that you could see. And so, yeah. So the story is how we got Miss Dakota. So we were on our way back from the coast and my dad was looking on his phone and he was looking at a pet shelter. And he was looking for dogs because our dog just passed away. Her name was Daisy and she was 15 years old and she died because I think it was um, her lungs or it was her... Um, yeah, I think it was her lungs. If not, then I'll probably tell you guys. Um, and so, oh wait, it was actually her kidneys. Um, so a kidney, it just wasn't working. And so we found a dog, a little do a little black dog named Noel. And then we found Joy and Angela. And they looked pretty familiar to each other. They were both tan. And so my dad was thinking after we unpack and everything, then we could go off to the shelter. So we got home, we unpacked, and then we went off to the shelter. And when we got there, um, Noelle has already been adopted, and same with Joy, except for Angela. So what happened to Angela, happened to Angela, <laughs> what happened to Angela is somebody got adopted right when we got her. Well, we took a look at her. And so that was sad, and, but there's more choices and we haven't even walked inside of the shelter yet. And so we went inside of where the dog, those dogs were and where the puppy and dogs are. And we looked around and then we saw this cute dog named McGee. And we wrote her down on our list because we usually bring a list with us so we could check them out. And then we saw this other dog that was a beagle, and his name was Odin. Maggie was a Pomeranian. And then we saw Grape in Dakota. Grape was, he looked like a big brother, and he was very not, well, he was very, he was not, I mean, he, was, he wasn't timid. He wasn't timid. And then Dakota, 
she was timid. She was very timid. She was like a little sister of this big brother that kept her safe. Her ears were down and she was scared. And she was really scared of everybody. She was just like, what's going on? She was only four months old. So we're like, you know what? We're gonna check those people, uh, those dogs out. And so when we got to the, where the top, we checked out McGee, but they told us no because McGee is not familiar with, you know, kids and she's she's bad with kids and then um what happened to odin is right when we tried to look at him then he got adopted which i'm really happy for him because he found a home and i'm really happy for that and then lastly grape we couldn't check him out yet because he was already check, being checked out by another family, so our only decision was Dakota. So Miss Dakota, she comes in, and when my mom picks her up, firstly, she clenches onto her, and she like, she's like, like this, and she was like clenching onto her shoulders and smelling her back, and she was very timid again. She was very scared, and she was shy, and she just, seemed hopeless and then I picked her up and she was just like shaking on me and then when my brother picked her up which is Lucas she was also shaking and same with my dad she tried to go like that and but she was a little bit too shy to do that to the rest of us and so then my mom knew that she was the one because she was very nice and she was very such a cute little dog and she, we knew that we wanted a timid dog not too, you know, barky and just too misbehaved. And so we, we talked to the manager, of course. And what happened was they had us bring our other big dog, dog named Bradley in to come check out Lucy because they wanted to see how they react. Because I have a, because we have a big dog and what if the big dog like tries to like eat her because Lucy was very small and Dakota was. And so on our way back to get Bradley, we thought of names. And so my mom was like, you know what? I think that Lucy's the perfect name. And then we all agreed on that. And so her name was Lucy. And so when we brought Bradley there, all he did was drool all over, but he didn't eat or do anything to her. He was very nice, and he's getting really old, so he's not, he's getting, t he's getting more timid. And so we could go get Lucy, so we went and got Lucy, and they got us a little care package. They gave us a little bag with a monkey toy that's ripped up now into pieces. And then they also gave her some dog kibble and everything like that. And so, yeah, that was the story. And I think that it's really cute. And right now, Lucy's breath is really bad. So we need to get her greenies from the store. Which, yeah. Her breath is really bad and we couldn't find any toothbrushes that would be healthy and we thought that, you know what, let's just use greenies because that's much, much easier and it's pretty much a toothbrush. So, thanks for watching. Remember to comment, share, subscribe, and like. Bye!